Hello everyone. Today we are going to do another tablet review. This time from Parblo. This is an A610 Plus and it's in a very adorable shiny cute box. I dig it. Um, admittedly I already opened this and then my computer <laughs> recording crashed. So we're doing it again, but that's cool. Um, yeah. As you can see, inside the tablet totally arrived, very nicely covered with protective wear, of which I have taken off. Super slim, very nice, uh, like pretty nice grips on the back. One, two, three, four, five. There are ten little hotkeys. Very nice. Um, inside, there's, of course, a base, a pen, which we will put over there. There is an easy how-to guide. Uh, something not, I usually don't see with tablets. There's this nice cloth. And a nifty glove. Sweet. Um, I've already installed the drivers on my own. In the description, I'll put a link to the website where you can. Um, my advice with this particular tablet is if you're having trouble getting pen pressure to work, make sure you go into settings and actually make sure Windows Ink is turned on. But we are going to test this out live here, so you'll be able to see. Oh, it comes with a cord too, which of course I already have plugged in because we're at round two. And it's pretty standard, it's just USB cord. Plug it in and go for it. So, as you can see here, um, in Photoshop, we have pen pressure, all that good stuff. Yeah, so I'm gonna mess around and just have some fun drawing for a bit. I'm not sure what their defaults are. Looks like their default bottom is zoom. We got an undo. There's a move. Oh, that brings up the tablet thing. Oh, and there's the color picker. Oh, and zoom out. Okay, so these are actually pretty useful, like just right off the bat. Zoom in, zoom out. Move, color pick. Cool. Cool, cool. I can work with that. I usually also have the, uh, the little bracket keys that look like this bound because those increase and decrease the size of your brush, which are pretty nifty. Okay, uh, so a couple troubleshooting things. When, because, you know, the most frustrating part with any tablet is getting the drivers to work on your thing. And if you do run into problems, you can just Google um, questions. They have a forum with a lot of help on their website. For me to get this running, I found you install the driver and then restart your computer. If you try to get everything set up right after, it's not going to work. Um, and you do have to have Windows Ink on. At least I do. I don't know if this will help you guys. Like if I turn Windows Ink off, it still works, but there's uh, no pen pressure. And with Windows Ink on, there's pen pressure. So, if pen pressure is your issue, definitely check that out. Um, but actual performance wise, I mean, this is pretty legit. Like, it's got. pretty good control. Um, A lot of you might be working in Paint Tool Sci if you want like that extra streamline in with your brush strokes, but in Photoshop you're just kind of winging it, but that's fine.
Yeah, overall I'd say it's a pretty solid tablet. I like most, I think, how many hotkeys it has and how light it is, honestly. Like, you reach a point where a tablet's a tablet, honestly. Um, anymore nowadays, they all have really high pressure sensitivity, which is what you want to be looking for. So it just kind of comes down to, you know, is the pen comfortable? Yeah, this pen's pretty lightweight, works well. Is the tablet easy to carry around? Yeah, at least I carry mine around in my backpack a lot. Um, I do um, a lot of work on a lot of different tablets, honestly. I have some Cintiqs, but those are usually more stationary. Um, when I travel, oof, <laughs> don't know where your eye is going. When I travel, I usually just carry around just flat, non-screened tablets. And this one would work really well for that. So yeah. All I can draw is eyes tonight. Too tired. But that's okay. The eternal mood. And draw some happy little trees. So yeah, 10 out of 10, nice, nice tablet, will help you follow your dreams and make many happy mistakes and happy accidents. Um, but yeah, if you have any questions, uh, like I said, please try to Google answers first. But, um, you can, I guess, ask here, and <laughs> I might, if I, if I see it, I might respond. I try. I'm a, I'm a busy human being, but I try. But, yeah. If any of you guys already have one, I would be curious to hear how you like it in the comments. Um, it's a newer brand, actually, so that's kind of cool. But, hey, I mean... Look at this shiny box. Look at this cute little cactuses. Look at the sky. Having a great time. I wish I had half as much fun drawing as this guy's having right now. <laughs> but yeah. Um, happy drawing. Good luck on your artistic adventures. <laughs>